tune in to News 19 for the latest weather forecast. But did you ever wonder how we get the information that we share with you? And by we, we mean our team of meteorologists. <laughs> <laughs> they get it right so often. Well, the current conditions keep keeping records and the other stats shared. News 19's meteorologist Corey Smith spent the day at the airport to show us the instruments that are actually used to tell us what's going on outside. We got near 70 degrees here in Columbia, 60 degrees right now, partly cloudy to mostly clear skies. Giving the forecast is more than just pointing at maps and telling temperatures. The science behind it can take years of learning, but meteorologists have a variety of tools to get their information each day. First, we need to head outside. I'm here at the Columbia Metro Airport, and we're about to head out onto the airfield to take a look at some equipment that tells us all we need to know about the weather. If you have ever flown out of Columbia, you might have seen this odd looking structure next to the taxiway. This is the, our automated surface observing system, and this is actually the official measurement for uh, the Columbia area. There's one here at the Columbia Airport uh, that take observations uh, constantly essentially for us and let us know what's going on in real time. This behemoth of a weather station contains sensors that record rainfall, temperature, dew point, precipitation type, wind speed and direction, cloud cover, and visibility. Systems are located at airports because they're really vital for air operations. Uh, pilots uh, coming into land really need information on uh, visibility, wind speed, wind direction, ceiling height. So this provides vital information to the airport but also helps us in the weather community knowing what's going on uh, in real time at locations all across the country. Orangeburg and Columbia Owens airports also contain this weather station referred to as an ASOS. Smaller communities may not have these elaborate setups, but can rely on smaller stations or public volunteers to provide us with weather observations from across the Midlands. It's pretty amazing that all these instruments work together just to give us the weather report. But now you know where we get the weather from. From the Columbia Metro Airport, I'm News 19 meteorologist Corey Smith.